back off now. I don't have to take that from you. Oh, I started a fight. This is awesome. <laughs> Name's Nils. I'm the cook up at Candlehearth Hall. Equip dual sword. I see. <laughs> equip... Equip axe. Okay. Let's go talk to this guy. Since our daughter was taken from us. Hello, friend. If it's a mercenary you're looking for, you found him. There's no stronger sword arm for hire in all Skyrim. Consider yourself hired. My blade is sharp and I thirst for battle. Onward, then. Okay. Lead on, then. All right, so we got a really strong follower now. Um, still have some gold, which is cool. I need to find a place to cook this food. Not really to do with my stuff anymore. I don't know. Now here we go. Can't just throw the big logs on the fire when I'm cutting wood. I pretend there's an imperial soldier's head on the stump. Hey, buddy, let me use the cooking pot. Thank you. All right, let's cook some food. We'll make apple cabbage stew. Make some cabbage soup. Horker loaf. Leg of goat roast. And I'm out of salt, so no more cooking for me. Name's Nils. Okay. What's this? Strong box. Hey, friend. Poor Nilsen has been wrecked since her sister. All right. Every night. This guy's crazy. <laughs> Full cabbage stew, some goat cheese, and an apple. I tell you the dragonborn comes with a voice wielding power. Hey, Stenmar. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. Let's have let's let's drink to our new sure. partnership. Feel free to hand me all the gold you want. Oh, he doesn't have anything. Oh, there's no, there's no, I don't have anything to drink. <laughs> Lead on then. All right, Senfar, I've, I've been running through the night, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay in my bed. All them dark elves and Argonians tear each other to pieces. Got some fresh baked bread and good cheese if you're after a bite to eat. Enjoy your stay, and don't break nothing. Actually, I need to get some healing potions. I made my fortune. And this guy's tough. He's gonna take a lot of damage for me. I'll be fine. <laughs> Master, you're far too old for this sort of journey. We don't know what's inside. Uh, I'll... I can... <coughs> just... <coughs> you see, you're not well. Have a seat, and I'll fetch you some tonic. 
Now, if there was a tonic that could help me, I would have found it by now. Hey, friend. I'm so close to the answer. What are you arguing about? Just a man's life work is all. I finally derived the location of the white file, but this doting busybody won't let me get it. If you tell me where it is, I can get it for you. You would do that? It's good to know there are some people out there who are willing to help an old man. It's buried with its maker, Corral Mill, in a long forsaken cave to the west of here. Corral Mill was a crafty one, even in death. You would need the skills of a master alchemist to reach his resting place. Luckily for you, I've already made the mixture. Here, take it. Please, don't, don't dally. I've wasted enough time arguing with my useless assistant here. Hmm. What do you have for sale? So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients? That's pretty good. I don't have the money. I just need simple healing potions. So expensive. <laughs> uh, I can't afford any of that. All right. Why are you? May the eight guide you to the file. What is the file? Why is the file so important to you? I've spent my entire life searching for it. <sighs> it brought me all the way to these frozen reaches from the warm embrace of Somerset Isle. Entire years spent in libraries, seeking out tiny villages with local legends that contain but a whisper of a hint of the file. I even named my shop after it, hoping that it might attract anyone who had heard of it. And now it's within my grasp. But the eight, it seems, <coughs> have chosen me for their amusement. For in my current condition, I'll never be able to lay my hands on it. What is the White File? A legendary bottle, forged in the days when Skyrim was just starting its turn to ice. A small container, made of the magically infused snow that first fell on the throat of the world. It is said that the file will replenish whatever fluid is placed inside of it. For an alchemist like myself, it is the most pure expression of my art. To create from nothingness is... poetry. I see. Why are you still standing around here? Go get me the file, you fool! My master can be... Hey, pal. I'll never have Master Norellian skill with potions. Do you think that the White File exists? It doesn't matter what I believe. Norellian does. And it might be the only thing keeping him alive right now. I don't appreciate loiterers. Until next time. That's what you're here to do. <laughs> uh, I just purchased a lot of things from you, sir. Okay, fine. <sighs> Let's go, Stenvar. All right. What time is it? Still have a little bit of time. Let me see. Need something? What do you have for sale? See for yourself. I need more potions than they but have they here. You need anything? Come see. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Oh, good. He does have potions.
No, I want his potions. Okay. I could sell him something, maybe. Oh, he likes... No, oh, that's... I'm buying from him. <laughs> Ugh, gotta be careful. Uh, what do you like, buddy? What would you think is valuable? Alright. Be sure to stop by Sadri's used wares in the break. All at reasonable prices. <laughs> Ooh, that, that'd be good. Okay. I. Let me see my. Skills, skills are close. Alright. Let's go cause some havoc. No. Stop with the quick skills. No! Uh, <laughs> if I say it, Connect does it. Alright. Let's go range out again. Okay, I'm really getting annoyed with the Connect right now. Let's go range out and see what we can find. Are you with me? Stenvar. Or Snedvar, whatever your name is. This is exciting. We are gonna cause some trouble. Okay, so we're gonna go past the statue up that way, and I think there's a fort. And we'll go kick some tail. Yeah! He has a great sword that he fights with. Yeah. Which is cool. Um, they're strong. Two handed weapons are, are very strong. Um, but, you know. They're. I don't know. They're not quite as good as. Hello, person of interest. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home to your mother. You shouldn't talk to me like that. Why? What are you gonna do? Cry? Back off, now. I don't have to take that from you. Oh, I started a fight. This is awesome. <laughs> I should have come. Ah, Stenvar! This was <laughs> That's all you got! Oh! Oh! No! Beg for your miserable life! Nice. All right. Grabbing everything. Let's go, Stenmar. Good job. <laughs> Good job. Picking fight and, and winning. Picking a 2v1 fight and winning. Jeez. I'm pathetic. <laughs> Is this the right way? Is this the way I went before? Hmm. I don't recall. No. It's not. This is that fort with all the. We'll come across some bandits who just finished roasting a rabbit on a spit. <laughs> Maybe they'll have a keg. <laughs> I like Stenvar. I like you, Stenvar. You are, you're my kind of uh, ruffian. <laughs> okay. No, I remember this. This way was actually that fort with all the wizards that I'm never going to be able to take. It's just a terrible idea. Equip bow. Equip bow. Thank you, Connect. Okay. Alright. Was it this way? Um, there's a mill. 
I know that up ahead, because it says there is. Um, this doesn't look like the right way either. It's past the farms. It's past the farms. That's what it is. Right? Hang on. Let me just look at the map instead of being retarded about this. Yeah, right there. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going the wrong way. All, all over the place. I'm going the wrong way. There's that tallow statue. I might have to, um... Might have to switch. Wares and weapons. Oh, All look at these guys. At fair prices. Hey, boys. Alright, I might come back and discuss some things with you. There's a camp there. Might come sell some stuff to those, those dudes. Um, now that I have Stenvar, I should be able to take on quite a bit more. Uh, baddies. Well, at least he's not. He's far behind me now. I was gonna say he doesn't follow. He doesn't follow a long way away like Sven, stupid Sven does. But I guess he does. Uh, he's just kind of a a dude. Keep up, Stenvar. He's not that far behind, thankfully. Um, and he's fast, so uh, he's fast at killing people, which is good. We need, that's what we need. He can get their attention with that big sword of his, and and then I can just sweep in and 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 jack him up and with my dual flurry, my dual swords. Speaking of which, I need to get some. Um, definitely need to get some 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 uh, perks going keep up with my perks. Um, I'm almost to... Am I... Oh, almost finished. Yeah, good. Almost finished with this... This level. With level three. So we cleared this. There was a fort beyond it. I'm guessing with more bandits. Because they usually... Usually are at forts. And they usually, you know... This is a tiny fort. Oh, thank goodness. I've been wandering alone for so long, I thought I'd never see another soul again. Calm down and tell me what happened. I was kidnapped by these bandits weeks ago. They locked me up in the towers near Mistwatch. I managed to pick the lock and slip out while the guard slept. But now, I'm completely lost. Can you help me, please? There's a town nearby in that direction. Do you need help getting there? Oh, thank you. But I should be fine now that you've shown me the way. But those bandits have to be stopped. They're at Mistwatch. Here, let me show you on your map. If you can stop them, you'll be a true hero. Nice. Mistwatch. Where's Mistwatch? Right there. No. Right... No, that's the Shrine of Azura. I still have that... Hooked up, huh? Missed watch. There. Right? Yeah, okay. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, what's that way? Hmm. There's a shrine up there. But in the meantime, there's a tower right here. Wolves. Nice work. Do you shoot a bow at them, Stenvar? You, you're good with a bow, too? That's great. Refugees rest. Okay, what's this? Decree of Monuments. 4th era 20. 
This tower once served as a meeting place where those brave souls who achieved safe passage to Skyrim would find loved ones and leave notice for others who could not be found. Let it stand in honor of those who had the strength and spirit to accept Skyrim's offer, untithed to any thane or hold, and self-governed with free worship, with no compensation to Skyrim or the Empire except as writ in the armistice of old, wheresoever those might still apply, and henceforth let no man or myrrh say that the sons and daughters of Kine are not without mercy or honor. We, the Jarls of Skyrim, hereby decree this site as monument to the struggle of those who fled their native homeland of Morrowind in the time following the Red Year. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, well let's let's look inside and see if there's anything other than a couple wolves to be had. Some bones, a book. A book. Okay, we'll take that. We won't read it right now. There's more books. And I don't know what you are. And a chest. Oh, with an adept lock. Alright, let's give that a try. Dang it. <laughs> Alright. Gotcha. Yes. Good stuff. And a level up. Wonderful. Perfect. This is great. Alright, let's move on. Uh, let's see here. Where does this go? Only that way. What's, what's the map look like? Okay, I guess it goes around this big mountain. I see. Let's stay a little closer to town. There's a fox. Equip bow. Equip bow. There we go. Oh, right in your head, too. And you're still running. Dang it. <laughs> A terrible hunter. Oh, the fox, the wolf's gonna eat him. Oh, what's up, wolf? <laughs> I guess I've gotten pretty decent with the bow and arrow since I've been playing gray ball. Wolves. Ah, oh, you suck, Stenvar. Come on, wolf, die already. There you go. Alright. Not bad. So let's see what's going on here. Is this a dragon... mound? Ingol Barrel. Barrow. Stenvar? Ally follow. There he is. Um. Huh. There's even a book I got about this guy. Ingol and the Sea Ghosts. Masser and Segunda passed over Isgamer's people as their fellowship landed in longboats upon the rocky shores of Saric Head on their journey from Atmora to Merith. Boats littered the coast, but Isgrimur did not count his kin, Ingols, among them. 
Isgamore commanded the sea ghost to surrender his kin, and a great gale darkened the sky. The seas thrashed and churned, and a wrathful storm approached. Isgormir took up the oars and rowed into the storm alone. Upon the sea, Isgormir wrestled the sea ghost, and the storm carried him along the jagged coast. Two fortnights passed without relief, until finally the storm broke. Come the next dawn. Ingle's longboat was found in the icy surf, but the vengeful sea ghost had already taken Ingle and his clansmen. In his terrible grief, Isgrimor slew a dozen, dozen beasts and burned them in honor of his fallen kinsmen. A barrow here was dug in the Atmoran tradition, and Ingle was laid to rest with rites and honors among his clansmen far below the rocky face of Sarak Head, the first children of the sky to perish in Tamriel. I'll take it, actually. Take the book! Salt. I don't know why they leave in salt. That's weird. And a breast. Uh, let's see here. Where's this barrow? Right here. <sighs> what do you think, Stenvar? Ally follow. Let's give it a try, I guess.